Hello everybody and welcome back to Mass Effect 2 Legendary Edition where oh my gosh everything's on fire. Also we have a completely new um Looks like they set up a barricade to try holding the mechs off. Look out. Keep moving, we need to get to the shuttles. Oh, uh, they have a completely new system of ammo. It does rely on actually picking up thermal clips and reloading, whereas in the previous game, it was based basically just on like cooldown management. Yeah. Shepard, security makes a closing in on your position. Ooh, look at me. Oh, I also really do like this uh, about. Uh, I didn't even see you. Um. I'm gonna cry. Um. <gasps> oh yeah, there's a whole new system of like abilities. I can't. Oh, I can't. Slave to ammo. Ammo pickups. Oh, okay. Hang on. Oh, okay. Uh, but abilities are different. You don't have access to all of them right out the get go. You just have a couple and, like, it you unlock stuff and uh, a lot of people. Oh, yeah. You get to like watch everybody dying. More reinforcements. Take the grenade. The I, I don't mind if I Use do. Here, I will save that. I am. Uh, I can't. <laughs> Very stressful way. It's uh, it's a very stressful way to learn how to play the game <laughs> under duress. <laughs> technology with me. I have been enhanced. Lock update. The cost of this project is astronomical. Over four billion credits so far. But nobody seems to care that we've gone over budget. I don't know where the boss gets all his money. Maybe it's better not to know. I just wish he'd kick a little more in my direction once in a while. Mmm, -hmm, that's a bad sign. To be fair, the illusion man gets has oodles of money. I don't even think he knows what to do with it all. But I'm sure these guys get paid astronomically well. Being a secret medical base doing top secret stuff. Oh no! Run! No! That was so excessive. That was so excessive using a freaking grenade launcher. She doesn't have to smile at you. She's worried Shepard might become the new favorite. Or maybe she is just a pure cold hearted. 
And maybe she doesn't have to emote for your pleasure, my dude. <sighs> oh, a snap. Nice, I don't usually look at that. Incoming. Oh, jeez, he scared me. Nice trip. Oh. Hi, Jacob. Please kill him, I can't aim. What are you doing here? Thought you were still a work in progress. Eh? Are you with Miranda? Yeah, sorry. I forgot this is all new to you right now. I'm Jacob Taylor. I've been stationed here for Hostiles detected. Damn it! Things must be worse than I thought if Miranda's got you running around. I'll fill you in, but we better get you to the shuttle first. I know this isn't the best time, but I'm sick of stumbling around when I don't know what's going on. Fair enough. I'll give you the quick version. You and your ship were attacked and destroyed. You were killed, dead as dead can be when they brought you here. Our scientists spent the last two years two putting years. you back together. You've been comatose, or worse, that whole time. Welcome back to your life. That's a... I'm having trouble wrapping my head around this. Yeah, I can imagine. The Alliance officially declared you killed in action. The whole galaxy thinks you're dead. And if we don't get to those shuttles, they'll be right. What, could you imagine, like, you get resurrected over four billion dollars to resurrect you? And you just die <laughs> here. Were there any other survivors from the Normandy? I'll tell you what. You help me finish off the <laughs> and I'll play 20 questions. He's like, please. Time. We're low on thermal clips, but I'm a biotic. Just give the order when you want me to hit him with the good stuff. You don't need my, oh my. Oh, don't come all the way over here. Okay. <laughs> I do like that it helps you keep track of your your uh Okay. I promised I'd answer your questions. What do you want to know? I mean, we're still in danger. Uh I do like that it helps you keep track of like your your progress on your um what do you call it? Your achievements though. My injuries. You said they spent two years rebuilding me. How bad were my injuries? I'm no doctor, but it was bad. When I first saw you, you were nothing but meat and tubes. Anywhere else, they'd have put you in a coffin. But Project Lazarus was different. Cutting edge technology. What do you mean, cloning? Cybernetics? I don't know the details. You'd have to ask the scientists. But I'm pretty sure you're not a clone. They wanted to bring you back exactly as you were. You're still you. You just might have a few extra bits and pieces now. Uh, what can you tell me about the project? Were there other test subjects? Project Lazarus only had one subject. The whole point was to bring you back. Just you. Even that was a challenge. Two years. All the top scientists. The best technology money could buy. Only human scientists, though. Because, as we'll see later, Cerberus is uh, a little bit... Mm, uh, rabid? <laughs> a little bit, I guess, nationalistic is the way to put it. A little bit, it's a little bit, a little much. Do you know anything about this attack? Who's behind it? What they're after? Damn if I know. I was getting ready for some shut eye, then bam, bunch of explosions. Next thing I know, every damn mech in the place starts shooting at us. I'm guessing it had to be an inside job. You'd need top security access to hack all the mechs. The last thing I remember is the Normandy blowing up. Did anyone else make it? Just about everybody survived. A few servicemen from the lower decks didn't get out. Navigator Presley was killed by an explosion. But everyone else, including the non-alliance crew, the Asari, Liara, and the Quarian, they all made it out alive. Do you know what any of them are doing now? I don't know, Commander. It's been two years. They've moved on. Left the Alliance. Could be anywhere. They were my team. If they knew I was alive, they'd come back. Maybe you can track them down after we get off the station. If we get off the station. I'm like, please, my friends, come back to me. What's your job here? Depends on who you ask. Technically, I'm Miranda's top lieutenant. But I'm just a soldier. I served five years in the Alliance before this. Now I'm in charge of the station's security. Usually a lot more dull than this. 
Normally I don't fire my gun unless it's target practice. Uh, Jacob actually has a really good, I think it's one comic, it might be a series of comics, but yeah, if you, if you check out his, uh, his comics, you see a lot more of his backstory and him and Miranda's history, and it's really good. I highly recommend it. When I first woke up, someone named Miranda was talking to me over the radio. We lost contact just before I ran into you. Miranda Lawson is the station's ranking officer. She led the Lazarus team. It was her job to bring you back to life, no matter what. Should have guessed she'd try to save you. She's not about to give up on you now. You said you lost contact. Could you tell what was happening? There was some gunfire and an explosion right before I lost her. She knows how to take care of herself. But I hope she's okay. They are good pals. Uh, potentially a tiny bit more. What's the quickest way to those shuttles? Depends where the mechs are thickest. It's probably best if we... Check. Check. Anyone on this frequency? Anybody still alive out there? Hello? Wilson, this is Jacob. I'm here with Commander Shepard. Just took out a wave of mechs over in D-Wing. Shepard's alive? How the hell? Never mind. You need to get her out of there. Get to the service tunnels and head for the network control room. Roger that, Wilson. Stay on this frequency. I think I remember a Wilson checking on me one time when I woke up. That's him. He's the chief medical tech. Answers directly to Miranda. Come on. The service tunnels are this way. It's a trap. He's like, how in the hell? And you're like, oh, it's just a surprise. No. He's actually really peeved I'm alive. <laughs> Hostiles detected. Oh, you're right. I need to use cover more. This room is crawling with mechs. The whole station is crawling with mechs. I'm doing the best I can. Fire. Wilson, find us another route out of here. Preferably one that doesn't lead straight into an enemy squad. Just keep Wilson, where are you? Server room B! Hurry! They're out of control! Up those stairs, Shepard! Oh god! I'm hit! They shot me! Oh, calm down. Things are just um Oh ho ho, see this is the kind of this is the kind of game we gotta look. They did it, but they brought me back. <laughs> Everyone keeps saying you're dead. You were totally 100% dead, and then they're like, "Well, there was some brain activity." And there was oh, it's all like it's all up in the air. Nobody, nobody actually has a clear answer. Shepherd, down here. Yeah, well, freaking all your friends are dead and crazy. Bastards got me in the leg. You were there the first time I regained consciousness. Yeah, that was me. <laughs> We talk about this after we fix my leg. Should be some metagel in the first aid station on the wall. Hopefully, there's enough to get him up and moving again. Grab the metagel from the first aid station. Yeah, on the he wall. already told me that. Thanks, Shepard. <clears throat> Never thought you'd save my life. Guess that makes us even now, hmm? I thought maybe I could shut down the security mechs, but whoever did this fried the whole system. Completely irreversible. We didn't ask what you were doing. Why do you even have security mech clearance? You were in the bio wing. Weren't you listening? I came here to try and fix this. Besides, I was shot. How do you explain that? You're all strangers to me. Let's get someplace safe and then we'll sort out whose fault it is. Right, Shepard. We need to find Miranda. We can't leave her behind. Forget about Miranda. She was over in D-Wing. The mechs were all over that sector. There's no way she survived. His neck. A bunch of mechs won't drop Miranda. She's alive. Then where His is she? His neck. Why haven't we heard from her? There are only two possible explanations. She's either dead, or she's a traitor. Then why did she wake me up and warn me about the attack? Okay, maybe she's not a traitor. 
but Ooh, that doesn't change the he's facts. He's backpedaling. We're here, she's not. We need to save ourselves. Mm. The shuttle bay is only a few. We can overload the canisters to clear a path to the shuttles. What? Oh, these ones? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's it. Let's get out of here. Which would have killed him. He was right on the canisters. Okay, we took him down. But this is getting tense. Shepard, if I tell you who we work for, I highly me. doubt it. This really isn't the time, Jacob. We won't make it if she's expecting a shot in the back. If you want to piss off the boss, it's your ass, Jacob. The Lazarus Project, the program that rebuilt you. <gasps> it's funded and controlled by dun, Cerberus. Dun, dun. We actually have heard of them. I think I ran into Cerberus a few times while I was investigating Saren. Some kind of pro-human splinter group, right? Well, that's what the Alliance wants people to believe. But there's more to it. The Alliance declared you dead. They gave up. Cerberus spent a fortune to bring you Private back. Private versus public. Look, I'd be suspicious too. But right now, we have to work together. I thought you deserved to know what's He is an honest man. Once we're off the station, I'll take you to the elusive man. He'll explain everything. I promise. Elusive man? Is he in charge of all this? Yeah. That's not his real name, of course. Nobody knows who he really is. It was a code name the Alliance used for him. Kind of stuck. I don't care what they did or what you say. I am not working with terrorists. You can tell it to the boss, but after we've saved our butts. Also, I really hate the, the like jog animation in this game. It's worse um, when you're not wearing your armor. Look at her, like her head's jutting forward like a Neanderthal. Also, we still have boob armor. In the year, our future Shepard is still wearing boob armor. Alert. I don't actually know what year it is, so I changed it. Um, okay, well, let's give it a whirl. Oh, yeah. Ah! ah. Okay, there's usually another ability you can get that lets you, like, I don't know, I think regain shields when you run in. I've actually gotten better at reloading in general just because of, um... Oh, come on. I think this is the other way, so I can't do it. Oh my gosh, why isn't it working? Oh my gosh, this is... Careful. I can't. I'm gonna die! Careful. Why won't it work? They at least explode. Have a nice trip. Have a nice trip. He says that all the time. Miranda, but you were dead. She sh what the hell are you she doing? She shot him in the throat. My job. Wilson betrayed us all. Mm. Even if you're sure, did he deserve that welcome? He sabotaged the security systems, killed my staff, and he would have killed us. 
You sure about that, Miranda? We've known Wilson for years. What if you're wrong? I'm never wrong. I thought you'd have learned that by now, Jacob. She's totally chill with me holding a gun in her face, too, you know? Like, she's just... She's just ice cold. If you say so. What's our next step? We get on the shuttle and go. My boss wants to speak to you. You mean the elusive man? I know you work for Cerberus. Ah, Jacob. I should have known your conscience would get the better of you. Lying to the commander isn't the way to get her to join our cause. Well, since we're getting everything out in the open, is there anything else you want to ask before we go, Commander? Why is your hair so poofy? It's not that poofy in the original. Convenient that you show up as we're leaving. Where were you during the attack? Besides trying to save your life? Yeah. Wilson figured out I was helping you and he sent an army of mechs to take me out. I got here as soon as I could. Probably a little too soon if you ask Wilson. <clears throat> what about the rest of the people on the station? This is the evac area. If they're not here now, they're not coming. We can't leave without knowing for sure. We need to go back and look. Don't you get it? The only one worth saving is you. Everyone else is expendable. She's right. We all knew the risks when we signed up. Without you, there's no point to any of this. Where are we going? Another Cerberus facility. The elusive man is waiting for you there. I'm not sure I trust you. This is the only shuttle off the station. You want to stay and rot with the mechs? Be my guest. She actually wouldn't let me 100%. She would she would drag me onto that shuttle. <laughs> she put too much work into me. You're the Lazarus Project's director, aren't you? That's right. I put two years of my life into this project. Into you. I mean, I, I, that's, I mean, two years isn't like a huge amount of time to invest into a project. What does Cerberus want from me? Maybe you should ask the elusive man when you meet him. He poured virtually unlimited resources into Lazarus. Obviously, he has some kind of plan for you. And I still can't, I, well, I'm, I think she does resent me, but it's uh, not for the reasons people might think I'm off the bat. I've had enough of this station to last a lifetime. Or two, in your case. Come on. Lifetime is a touchy word now. This is nice and all, but where's my husband? <laughs> Before you meet with the elusive man, we need to ask a few questions to evaluate your condition. Mm. Come on, Miranda. More tests? Shepard took down those mechs without any uh, trouble. Oh, some trouble. That has to be good enough. It's been two years since the attack. The elusive man needs to know that Shepard's personality and memories are intact. Ask the questions. Oh, why? Why, uh, why him? Why not you? Did you say two years? I've been gone that We've long. established this already. Two years and 12 days. And you were on an operating table for most of it. The sooner we start, the sooner we can be done. Start with personal history. Okay. Records show you grew up on Earth. Tough environment, no parents. You enlisted and won a medal fighting Batarians during the Skillian Blitz. Do you remember that? A lot of lives depended on me holding that position. I did what I had to. However you want to put it, it was damn impressive. I had friends who were there. Satisfied, Miranda? Almost. Let's try something more recent. Vermeer, where you destroyed Saren's cloning facility. You had to leave one of your squad behind to die in the blast. Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams was killed in action. It was your call. Why did you leave her behind? Mm. I left a friend to die that day, and I didn't do it casually. But I had to save as many people as I could. Ash gave her life for the rest of the team. Without her, I couldn't have stopped Saren. She died a hero. I understand, Commander. And I wasn't judging your decision. Everybody at Cerberus knows that cloning facility had to be destroyed. There are other tests we really should run. Come on, Miranda. Enough with the quizzes. The memories are there, and I can vouch for Shepard's combat skills personally. I suppose you're right. We'll have to hope the elusive man accepts our little field test as evidence enough. <laughs> FTL travel between systems. Uh. The elusive man is waiting for you in the other room. Talk to me. The elusive man is nope. waiting for you in the other okay. room. Oh yeah, customize my gear. Oh yes, oh yeah. <laughs> yes, I forgot you can get, you can start out with the dress. Also, this. Oh, I'm so excited for this. I think 
think this was a DLC? Yeah, it was a DLC. I actually dressed up as this version of Shepard for Comic-Con once. Uh, it looks really good. Let's see if I can... Yeah. So we can get other, uh... What do you call it? Like, uh... Chest plates and stuff. You can get lots of cool new armor in this game. It's not just this armor. We have time. We should. Maybe we have time. I don't know. Let's go talk to the elusive man. So it turns out there wasn't any time. The conversation with the elusive man took a little bit longer than I anticipated. Um, so we're going to call it there. But thank you all so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I want to give an extra special shout out to my patrons. To my patrons. Um, especially to my sapling tier patrons, Scalamonger. Thank you so much. And Reese Galito. Thank you so much. Thank you both again so, so much. <laughs> You're great. Um, and I want to give an extra special shout out. Extra, extra special shout out to my tree tier patron, Christopher. And I'm just really glad that you guys are here and chilling and and having a good time i hope <laughs> so i see you all in the comments from time to time and uh, i appreciate it a lot so um yeah thank you all so much for watching and i hope to see you in the next one